Yeah, so although you get a bit worried sometimes, things turn out. Sometimes you think, oh, I'm glad I did this route now. Look, beautiful view I've got from up here. Little sailing vessel there, look. Fishing vessel, I spat. Coming from Porlock with the oysters. Yeah, so I'm glad now that I I came here to this. These are, reminds me of um, Holford. They've got memorial trees, and these are like memorial trees, aren't they? Maybe it's a thing they do in, in on Exmoor. They do these memorial trees because there's a a cross over there, and then we've got somebody's got flowers placed here. Look for somebody. <sighs> And what beautiful view! Oh, hello, I'm just doing a video. I'll try not to get you on it. Wait a minute. What are you saying? What a beautiful place. They're full of the joys of love. A young couple just passed me with a dog. I saw, I was seeing them earlier and they're laughing then. They're laughing in the sunshine. Laughing in the sunshine. <sighs> yeah, look at that. Yeah, I'm glad I, I, I missed all this last time, you see. Because I didn't come this way. And I would have still been walking up through those woods if I'd taken the other route. <sighs> Norfil, here we go. Starting to we'll probably join up with it now. And what's in there? Some sort of stone structure. Let me just zoom in a minute. I don't know what that is. It's private anyway. Probably a monument to somebody else. Now those kids, young people that just passed me, they were on a lower track that I would have taken, which I took before. And they've obviously done a circle. What I don't want to do is end up on the track and have to, you know, you know what I mean? But anyway, I reckon we should be going to just follow this, I suppose, now. I mean, what they don't do when they're with these um, signs, see there's a path going down there and there's one going up here. See, so I'm going to keep on the higher one. Because that looks like you don't want to go down, just stay up. Might even be a gate in a minute to lead you to that stone. Although it could be a personal memorial, I see. Right, I've just done a little bit more video than I intended. Just to get us back on the straight and narrow. I'm bordering a wood. And I hope this is the path, because there was a fork back there. <sighs> they really need somebody to come out, you know, again, and put a few more little arrows in here and there, or a bit of paint or something. <sighs> All I know, if you, you don't have to go down, don't. Stay up. I probably knew, I'm probably no further along than I was if I'd taken the lower path. Right, I'm going to turn off for a while. Remember, and I've only got one memory card after this one. Right, the diversion took me slightly longer, but it was worth it to stand up by those beautiful pine trees and see all the beautiful views.
because when you're just in the wood walking you don't see any of that so I'm glad I've done that but unfortunately I lost a whole bottle nearly a whole bottle of water I'd take an extra today because it's been a really hot day and a very strenuous walk I haven't even started the strenuous bit yet and I've lost a bottle of water I think when I took my hat out because it was getting hot to put my hat on I know I took a, some water then and I, and I left it at the gate nearly a whole bottle of water what I've got now is a bottle of water about a pint, that's all I normally take a lot more than that I've got some oranges and I've got a bottle of lemon juice which is not thirsty quenching but it's still liquid what I'm going to do I'm going to have to ration myself but I'm not going in theory I ain't walking as far as yesterday it's just it's going to be more strenuous and there's going to be nowhere to get water that's why I brought the extra bottle and I was relaxed knowing I had that extra bottle of water now I'm going to have to ration on a hot day I'm going to have to ration I'm going to have to dilute that lemon juice because it's going to be so makes your mouth dry Anyway, I've eventually got here to the top of North Hill. I think I have come out a slightly different place. Um, but I, I am a bit concerned that I lost that water. Yeah, and I never came out here last time. I'm going to head over there. Let me just go to this... Um, a minute, hold on. Let's turn off a minute. Right, right over there in the distance. Right over there's Dunkery Beacon. That, see it? There's a car on the top. I think that's Dunkery Beacon or it could be Robin Howe. I think it's more likely to be the beacon. And there's all the woods. Right. People coming. Alright, put it on 